Hey, my name is Alexander Trifonov. I'm head of PR at Gaijin Entertainment. So let's talk about the NVIDIA Shield tablet. How are you guys been working with NVIDIA to bring War Thunder onto this platform? NVIDIA is our long-term partner because we are a PC developer at heart and we are a PC developer for 12 years already. So it's only natural that we are huge friends with NVIDIA. So they, when they approached us about this new platform, we were very excited because uh, our goal is to make War Thunder playable on any device, anywhere you want. And a Shield tablet is a very great example of this because you can take it with you if you are using LTE version. You can play it on, on the train, in the traffic jam, wherever you want. And when you come home, you can plug it in uh, to your TV and then sit on your couch, take a gamepad and have uh, almost the same experience as on home console because Tegra K1 is a very powerful graphics chip and it allowed us to create one of the best looking games on Android tablets uh, as of now, I believe. Can you talk a little about the Tegra K1 and how close to what people experience on the PC this mobile version will be? Well, basically it is the same game. So when you plug it uh, to, when you connect it to your TV and use the gamepad, it's almost exactly the same as if you were sitting uh, with your PC connected to your TV and using some gamepad. So you hardly notice any difference. Well, the graphic quality is a little lower, but it's only little. It's, uh, it's like on medium settings on PC. And uh, well, our goal was to make it as uh, cross-platform and uh, as uh, similar to all other versions as possible. So you can uh, take your tablet, you can use your account on this tablet, you can uh, then switch to a PC and play on PC, you can then switch to macOS and play it on macOS, all with the same account, on the same server, with your friends from all other platforms. So we think this uh, Shield tablet exemplifies our vision for War Thunder and we are happy, very happy to work with this device. Can you talk a little about the controls and how you're using both the touchscreen on the tablet as well as the controller for controls of War Thunder? Okay, uh, thanks uh, to NVIDIA uh, Vision <laughs> for this tablet. Uh, they, they know that it's hard to control uh, like action-packed games on uh, tablets. But anyway, we do our best uh, to provide uh, suitable touch controls for War Thunder version and we are going to use them in a separate Android version uh, as well because there will be a uh, standalone, uh, not standalone, sorry, there will be an Android version of War Thunder as well uh, which will be running on any other tablets. Uh, it will look worse of course <laughs> but it will be also cross-platform uh, with PC and all other platforms. Uh, anyway, uh, the most important thing about uh, Shell Tablet is the gamepad. We really like this gamepad because uh, not only it is high quality, but it also has the touchpad. So uh, you can use the touchpad like you use the mouse in PC version to navigate the menus, stuff like this. So it's really, really very easy to use. 